Today I'm drafting my five-a-side dream team with So Rare. This is So Rare, a game we're about to build our team consisting of all of the players you see right here. But as you can see at the top of the screen, we're only gonna have 100 points to build this entire team. Okay, before I build my team, make sure you guys check out So Rare with the link in the description. They have football, NBA, and MLB games to play. If you guys use my link and get five limited players, we'll each get a free player. So make sure you guys sign up using that link. Okay, let's build this team. So to get to this brand new game mode, which again, this game mode is completely free to play. We will go to football and it should take you to the play screen where you have the option to click global cup as soon as you click that we will click draft and we will be in to draft our team so how this is going to work 100 points to draft two forwards two midfielders two defenders and two goalkeepers after we draft the team we'll choose the best five to play and their performance how they do on the pitch will determine how high they score throughout this competition i'll explain more on the scoring later but let's draft this team now we need to be smart only 100 points so as much as i want to take messi i don't know if i should he is one of their new ambassadors though so so i think he's gonna be worth the points messi is our first selection you'll see he gets added to the top of our screen so we have one more forward to choose from i feel like it would be wrong if i went for anyone but pulisic as we scroll further down to the bottom of the screen the players become worth a little bit less I'm trying to see if there'd be any down here that we could potentially get for a steal in price. I'm going to take Christian Pulisic. We're going to go for him and Messi. And as soon as we choose him, it will pull us up to our midfielder selection. Okay, I only have 65 points remaining and I still have six players left to draft. For midfielders, I'm going to avoid players here up towards the top. All right, in the midfield, I am going to take gonna go a little bit further down for our next selection i want to save some points here i'm gonna go for the australian i'm gonna go for aaron moy that might that might have been a mistake okay two defenders are up next we have 44 points left to spend virgil van dyke the most expensive defender he would cost 17 points we actually could ball out and get him i'm trying to find the team that i think will concede the least amount of goals this world cup who has the easiest group i'm gonna go for one of the french defenders and i'm gonna take theo hernandez and let's go for another Amer american we are gonna go for Serginio Dest. 19 points left and two goalkeepers. I'm American. I'm, I'm going with a lot of American players here. I actually rate Mac Turner. I think he's going to have a good group stage, so we'll select him. And here's where I've broken the rules because we cannot draft more than two players from one country. This game's literally telling me to stop being an American right now. I probably needed someone to tell me that because my expectations are way too high for the USA. All right, I'm taking Jordan Pickford as my goalkeeper and then my backup keeper. I only have six points to spend. <laughs> we'll take the Cameroonian goalkeeper. Look at that man's Love last it. name. How am I meant to say that? So we have our players in. I will now click confirm draft. And we are now going to compose our starting five from the players we just drafted. We got the stadium walk in. And we will start now with our goalkeeper, who's obviously going to be Pickford. So we can only start one defender. I'm going to take Theo Hernandez. In the midfield, we will go. And up front, we will go for Lionel Messi. And then we get one extra player to add in. So that can either be Aaron Moy, Christian Pulisic, or Serginho guest i gotta go for the main man pulisic and we officially have our starting five but here's where things get interesting we get to choose one player as a captain who will receive a 20 percent boost it's gotta be messy right I, I have to go with messy we will confirm our starting five and our team is in now the squad that we create and you create as well will be put up against everyone in the world who makes a squad but i'm also creating a group for the b4 fans so now that my team's created we will create the private league right so we got the b ford squad also leave this link in the description so you guys can join my league right now i'm the only member Ooh. so please join guys but once you create your team here's how the scoring will work so let's go ahead and take messi for example he has his first game against saudi arabia so we've clicked on messi and we can see from some of his previous matches how the scoring works so rare tracks over 40 stats all around when players are on the field tad up a score for them at the end of the match so this game right here messi got a perfect score of 100 but when you click on every player you can see some of their past results so once you pick your team you can track your team in real life as they play and don't worry if your team doesn't perform in the group stage you'll be able to add four new players to your initial squad on these following dates so we have before the round of 16 from november 29th to december 3rd we have a before the quarterfinals december 3rd to december 9th and then before the semifinals december 9th to december 13th so when picking your players obviously you want them to make it further in the competition but if 
they don't, you will have the option to add more players in the future. Here's what is on the line for you to win. Again, this is great. There's prizes on the line and it's literally free, so it will cost you nothing. We have weekly rewards, which include giving you guys cards in so rare that you will be able to use. And when I say cards, these are collectible cards within so rare. So obviously you can get free cards. All of the ones with the white borders are considered free or as so rare likes to call them common cards. But as you move up the ranks, gold cards, you can collect and sell for actual money. So obviously I have this American Timothy Chandler. He's a little bit less expensive. You can buy him for as much as a dollar. But if you wanted to get a more rare version of him, it might cost you a little bit more. And you can use these collectibles to compete in loads of other competitions. There's so many to choose from. It'd be impossible to explain them all in one video. Lost my train of thought here. The rewards for this global cup, you have 100,000 national series cards, 5,000 limited cards, a chance to win some Ethereum, and then everyone who participates gets to keep their World Cup cards that they add to their team. And then we get the big prize is the overall leaderboard. So if you come first to fifth place, you will each get a pair of tickets to a once in a lifetime experience with Zinedine Zidane. That's awesome. Six through 10th, receive VIP tickets to future matches. We got Ethereum, we got signed kits, and so much more with this game and so rare. So before we end, I want you guys to rate my team in the comments and tweet me the teams that you build. Thanks for watching the video. Download the game, link in the description. Join my private league as well in the description. Click to watch another video. And with that, see you boys later.